in Prodigy 4.2.0, only on the Mat Connect, we have added a very cool feature, which is in the calculator of the Prodigy software. So if I select the calculator application, I will be brought to my calculator. There is a new button inside my calculator. Again, my quick settings on the top left corner right under the back button. If I select that, I will be brought to a menu. My first option on top is mode. So if I select mode, I have three modes now. Previously in other versions, I had standard mode, which is your basic calculator with only addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. It's only really the basic calculator. We had also scientific mode, which is a calculator with the addition of uh, sine, cosine, tan, a bit of logarithmic uh, uh, functions. And now with this new software update, we have the graphing mode. So the graphing mode is powered by the Desmos interface. So what this can do is that it offers you all the calculations. You can enter a, a formula and have it gra graphed out for you. So by clicking the two arrows at the bottom left corner of the um, pad, you're, you'll be brought to uh, another interface, which will have all the other functions. You'll have some trigonometry functions, which you can have sine, cosine, tan, and whatever. And then if you press the INV button or inverse button, this will give you the inverse of those functions. I can also select the HYP button and this will give me the hypotenuse of those functions. And also, besides the trigonometry function, I can use the MISC functions. So by pressing the MISC button, I will be brought to another interface which has MISC1 and MISC2 functions. In the first mix, MISC uh, functions, you have the E, the logs, all the um, uh, logarithmic um, functions that are in there. And then MISC2 are the integrals, derivative, and things like our ceiling, floor, um, and everything like that, that is in that menu. For this first version, the derivative, derivative and the integral uh, functions do not work uh, at 100%, so beware. But besides that, uh, everything should work uh, perfectly. So if I do an example here, I will hit my, I will click on my two arrow button. I will say x is equal to sine y, close the parenthesis, and then click on my graph button, which is on the right hand side of the screen. This will generate the graph on my screen. And this is where this is where my graph is. It will take the color of the grid, which I had in purple, and it will take the background, which I had black or white on black, and it will keep the same appearance or the same contrast colors as you had set in the calculator. You have a mini uh, button banner at the bottom, which has a back button, or the plus and the minus to zoom in or zoom out of the function. So then you can see the full array of that graph. If I want to go back to my calculator, I can click on the back button and I'm back to my calculator. So this is how you use uh, the Desmos calculator or the graphing uh, calculator in Prodigy. I think this is going to be very useful for students learning um, how these uh, functions work.